Hello everyone, uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to install the RC mod and what you can do with the RC mod, so yeah, it's a pretty cool mod. Um, so first, let's first update your Minecraft. So you have a clean, nice Minecraft. Always nice. So first update, don't log in. Oh. That's not what I want. Alright, let's first update it, I will be back when it's done. So you see my Minecraft is first updated, it's version 1.4.2. Um, probably this installation thing will also work for a later version of Minecraft. Uh, I'm not sure, but I think it is. So now let's um, install it. First you need to download um, Minecraft Forge and the RC mod itself. I have the download links in the description below. So you can just download it over there. And there also is a link to uh, WinRAR, or you, because you need to open this with WinRAR or 7-Zip, and I prefer WinRAR, so I have, to, I have a download link in the description. Alright, um, go to your Minecraft directory, just type percent app data percent and hit enter. Then go to dot .minecraft, and go to bin, and then go to minecraft.jar. Alright. So, then get your Minecraft Forge and open it. Oh, yes. Alright, and you can highlight this. So, you need to highlight this. So, con uh, press Ctrl A. And then just drag it, drag these files in Minecraft Jar. So, come on. Oh, okay. And you can close Minecraft Forge and delete meta inf because else mods won't work. And do this after you have installed Minecraft Forge because Minecraft Forge also has uh, a meta inf folder in his in in the folder. So you no, know, else you need to delete it twice so, like this. You can close Minecraft the jar and then go back to your bin and just go back one. So you see the backup bin configuration blah blah and then search for a map called mods. Um, if you don't got this map this folder, sorry, this folder, um, then just make one. So go to uh, new folder and just call it oh then just call it mods like this. But I already um, got this. So just open it and don't mind these other things that are other mods and just get your RC mod the, the uh, WinRAR file and just drag it in the folder mods like this so now it's now you can close it and now it should work so just open up your Minecraft so if you are in your Minecraft you probably see now these new things in the left corner and you see the the, the versions of the mods and you see Minecraft Forge and for mods loaded, for mods active. So if you go to mods, you can see which mods are active. And you can see Minecraft Coder Pack, um, Forge Mod Loader, and Minecraft Forge and the RC mod. And this, of course, is the important one. Alright, click done. And just go to um, a world you want. I prefer a flat world because some of these things are pretty difficult to handle. Alright, well, just make it a. Just. Uh, uh, it day. All right. So um, to get through these things, just go to Redstone, and you see here the two remote controls, and the RC boat, the RC car, the RC trainer is uh, just uh, a plane, and your RC F1, 102. It's like a, a jet fighter, and the RC XD. All right. Let's start with the um, RC car. Just place it with your um, right mouse button. Then go to an empty slot and just right click on the car. And you see a redstone thing appears on it. So now it's activated. Then go to the control. And for the RC car and the boat, you need this little controller. And right click it just in the air. And it's now it's turned on. And you see setup ready. Oh, I'm already ready. And you can see the speed, the, the height, and 
with a weapon and it's do it don't got a weapon. So just to actually see where the car is going, just press F5, press F5, F5, and now you're now you're close to the car, so you can better see what it's doing. If you press F5 again, you see it from a, a longer distance. And if you press F5 again, you see it from the front. So I think this is pretty nice. Well, pretty nice view. You press F5 again, you see it from your own view, or own point of view. Um, yeah, with your RC car, you can just drive. But don't drive against a block or something, because it will explode. Maybe if I... Well, let's ride against a sheep. Well, I can just ride between his legs. Well, if you drive against one block, well, I just drive against this one. It will explode. Or, no, not explode. It will just disappear. So, alright, let's do the RC boat. Of course, you need water for this. And I just have a little pool thing here. Also, right click on this and then get this uh, controller and just, yeah, you all do, do the same with the F5 to get in the boat. And just the controls are the same, just W, A, D, and S to just W to get forward, D to get right, A to get left, and S to get, uh, get backwards. And yeah, you can just, well, just play with it. And just right click it to get out of the boat, by the way. Um, Alright, let's do the RCXD. Just place RCXD and also right click it with an empty slot. And then go to the bigger controller and also right, uh, right click it. Now it's on. Oh. Oh. Oh, right. Now it's. Wait, it's not going well. Uh, whoop. I think it's not working where you have multiple vehicles. Yeah. Alright, now it's working. So just press F5, F5, and you're in the RCXD. Um, I think a lot of people will know the RCXD, of course, uh, from Call of Duty. And yeah, it's can, you can also explode this. You see a weapon is now off. To activate this, press F. You see now it's armed. And to activate it, just press space. So let's ride in. Uh, well, explode at the cow. And boom. Alright, the cow is dead, and it's, well, it's making a pretty big hole, as you can see, and so it's pretty effective, and pretty nice. Alright, let's do the plane, the normal plane, let's say normal plane, um, also right click this, One. Yeah. to activate it, then also get this larger controller, and also F5, 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 and here you also got uh, W, oh wait, my headset, press W to go forward, uh, S to get back, A to get uh, left, and D to get right, but to get uh, up, just press the uh, arrow down, the down arrow, and of course arrow up to just go down, or, and the right arrow to get to the right, like this, and the left arrow to get the left, so you can just play with it. And well, it's not really rendering right now, but you already see these things, these plane, these planes and stuff are really hard to handle. I'm not. Well, I think I did just destroyed it. Right, let's try it another time. It's pretty pretty hard to steer, and you know you don't know where you're going. So just, but also how longer you push uh, W, the longer it will. Um, make speed so harder it will go. First step I push W and now I'm going like um, 9 meter per second going a bit harder and when I go up you see my speed is going down when you go down my speed is going up and you can just play with it. If you go too fast it's you know, it's pretty hard to handle well let's try to whoop, whoop. No. you see they're, they're pretty they're pretty, um, yeah, they're, they're dead pretty fast. Let's say that. I don't know the word. All right, the jet fighter. It's the, the coolest one. It really looks pretty nice, I think. And also get this controller and just press a five, uh, five. And the same controls for the normal plane. Uh, and let, um, except for this, you have a weapon. So press F, and then. Oh, space to fire this. 
Whoa, 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 no, no. Get up, get up. Alright, I don't know what the fuck it's doing. Sorry for my language. Come on, just get to the sun. Alright. Um. Oh. Alright. Another cool thing of this jet is because the, the wheels. You know, they're going into the plane when you're flying and when you're landing. They're going out so you can land. Uh, so now it's armed, but I press space. I can't fire. I thought it was space to fire it, but I'm not sure. Oh, don't crash, please. So yeah, it's just pretty fun to just try try this out, you know, and just learn how to. Oh, I can't go backwards. All right, it's bit buggy right now so yeah just try it out and you will learn how to fly by yourself and because it's pretty hard to fly and uh, thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed and you learned something maybe it was helpful i don't know well thank you guys for watching see you guys later and goodbye <laughs>